guys, what's up? Welcome back to a review on pocket tanks. So, the reason I'm doing this is... I'm going to turn that down. The reason I'm doing this is... <coughs> because I saw Dan play this. He was a complete noob. He didn't know what he was doing. So, I'm just going to go around right here. Rank what's the best to use. And what's the worst? So, like, they added this, 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 uh, these five right here to the game. And, and there's more you have to buy. You can get the deluxe version for five bucks. I might get that. <coughs> Basically, the tracer does no damage, Dan. It's just, like, zero. That's every shot. <coughs> so, like, magic wall, that's completely useless. Unless it's literally right on top of you them it's not doing nothing uh groundhog worm and homing worm homing worm you got to make sure it stays underground then it stops and goes up at the person otherwise it, these two are completely crap skipper that you get four bounce has to be directed to get full damage tommy gun I don't, well, you know, that's a good gun. This is what you get out of the divots with those kinds of things. Uh, that is completely useless almost. That you shoot underground at them. Like, you don't shoot up because they don't go back down. They just go straight. They can go through the ground. And I'll show you what I mean real quick. Basically, this is what I mean. You want to make sure you get down. I'm not really aiming right now. And then you want to put power all the way up. Power doesn't mean how much damage it does. It just means how far it will go. See, so like that right there. And I noticed he didn't pick Superstar first. Which I cringe at that. Superstar is possibly the best one in the game to get. Watch. And the angle I don't really ever change. Like, because this. It's a crazy good weapon. Yeah, 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 you notice that oh, by now. Uh, 156 from one hit. Uh, fleet, like all these. That's my phone. What the heck? That's a really good one. Why would you get out? The, like, Groundhog does a lot of damage if you get hit. But, like, to get out, you want to, like, use Dirt Mover, any of those moving things, and, uh, Crazy Ivan. Uh,. And all those, like, that will move it better. Not chain reaction. Uh, dirt ball and dirt, uh, triangle one. Those things trap them in dirt. That moves around that. You want to get in front of them a little bit. That, that's not that powerful. Uh, now, I'm going to go over the settings. What's the best settings? No, out. Let me out. Let me out. So, basically, here's what I did. I allow all of them, so, game settings though, I put on random, explosion size large, explosion kick large, turret orientation, oh yeah, and sniper rifle, that's a direct hit, you have to, or else it does nothing, but if you get a direct hit, it's 100 damage, wind speed, I put none, I don't know what that is, none again, never, so like, that's the best settings to have and what I do which uh, you gotta pick yellow man or else that's ugly that's decent because that's my second favorite uh no 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 what the heck it got laggy so basically you want to pick that and I always pick difficulty one I'll try that difficulty 10 ones. so that was basically my my review on pocket tanks Hopefully Dan learns from this, since he is not good. Like, uh, all these, you don't want to pick any of these. Until the last time with that, that never. This, if you want to just go for, like, what I do, dirt, get that. Get all the things that can move the dirt. Spider's good, amazing. Yeah, dirt slinger. Zapper, just get in the, about, a little range. That's a fire. It does a lot of damage, but you gotta get it near. Hillstorm moves, not that much damage. Uh, firecracker, that's pretty good. Homing missile, shoot as far as you can. It'll 
it's like holding one. It stops at the person like this. Watch. See? Anyway, guys, that was my review on pocket tanks. Hopefully, you'll, you'll learn from this, and I'll see you all.